Thanks, Brody. Barry, first, it's truly an honor to evaluate your speech as I'm sure I, you know, really can only learn from you at this point. But uh, so what I'll discuss today is what I've learned from you. To begin, I really wasn't ready for you to transport us directly into your economic development propaganda speech this morning. But I am sure if I had kids, they would have looked up from their video games, at least briefly, if not to only see the source of the incredibly confident, captivating, and anachronous or anachronous or alacritous, whatever, voice on the computer. Speaking of voice, I'm not sure why you hired a 1960s wartime radio announcer to do your speech when you were perfectly capable of doing it yourself, but it was entertaining. The vocal variety was not only keeping us on the edge of our seats, but completely on point for the delivery of this message, truly delivered with alacrity. I just have to say, my mom's basement is extremely comfortable and helps me keep my spending footprint pretty down. So just gotta say, uh, but you know, your message was very clear, concise, humorous, and kept our interest level high. In fact, you checked off all the boxes on the evaluation sheet by using gestures, exactly what a propagandist would use, eye contact, how else we control the minds of young people globally, and extreme comfort, which puts us at ease while you indoctrinate us with democracy. Okay, so here is what I learned. I think you could say your research for this speech has been performed over your life experience. Your content and style work perfectly here. I will not fo uh, focus on the content, though tempting, but focus on your speech behavior. You began by qualifying the speech or who the speech was for and who it was not for. But I definitely want to hear the speech for the failures to launch. That's going to be great. What a great way to get everyone's attention because the people that are not supposed to hear it are, they just want to listen more closely. At one time, you said, go back to number four. What an awesome way to engage active recall in the audience, which helps, you know, people remember the earlier parts of your speech. But one suggestion is uh, to help people even further and also increase your speech time uh, is to give us a short summary of what number four was, since we don't have the table of contents to go back to and remind us. Uh, the other thing is, it was excellent how you organized your speech into the tips first, and then you started a discussion on that. I think that's where you're really going to increase the body of your speeches in that discussion portion. Um, so uh, maybe just a little more. Um, uh, development of that part of it, uh, but great organization and really excited to see where you continue to take this speech. Great job, Barry.